McLean Stadium erupted with SEC chance as Baylor ran out the clock to defeat Texas yesterday afternoon. The Longhorns had them at one point, leading by as many as 11 points, but per usual, they couldn't close it out in the second half. And when you look at the final score, it looks like things were going pretty well for Baylor, but they too faced adversity during the game. Head coach Dave Aranda has been stressing all season long the importance of coming out hot and finishing strong. The Bears did one of the two. Gary Bohannon threw an interception on the opening draft of the game, which led to a Longhorn score and to open the second half, the Bears gave up another quick seven to Texas, but its defense was able to hold the horns to just three points in the fourth quarter while its offense dropped 14. Aranda spoke after the game about the fight from his team right from the jump. Starting fast, I think that was the intention. And then I think, you know, uh, getting punched in the, in the face by a really good Texas team, I think was anticipated. And so, uh, it was good that we were able to get our hands back up and throw some of them, throw some punches of our own. Uh, proud of this team. The Bears jumped to number 14 in this week's AP poll, and they'll look to stay a one-loss team as they travel to take on the three and five Horned Frogs on Saturday afternoon. That kick is set for 2.30 p.m. in Fort Worth. And when the Bears play at the Carter this weekend, the Horned Frogs will be coached by interim head coach Jerry Kill, as Gary Patterson is out as head coach at TCU after 22 years with the program. Patterson and the team mutually agreed to part ways, according to athletic director Jeremiah Donati. Donati says he was given the option to finish out the season, but felt it was in the team's best interest to step down immediately.